guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Thursday, November 9th, and I just did my big two-week grocery shopping trip. Well, most of it. Elijah's birthday party is this weekend, and I'm gonna have cake and party food in the fridge, so there are some things that I didn't get because I knew that I wouldn't have room for them. So I plan on going back on Monday and probably filming a haul for that. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you all the meal plan, and then we'll get into what I bought. So this meal plan will be for the 9th through the 22nd, and the 22nd is Thanksgiving, which we are actually doing at my house this year. So, for the 9th, we are having grilled cheese and tomato soup, or I might have a BLT. The 10th is Elijah's birthday party. We are doing a hot dog bar. So, a hot dog, I'm making a copycat varsity chili. If you're from the Georgia area, you know the varsity, and making their chili for that. Then Sunday, I've got balsamic chicken and veggies. That's a one pan meal. Then we've got beef and chorizo nachos. I'm gonna use the chorizo from the Kroger Free Friday. Chicken fried rice, beef and cheese tortellini bake. That's just something I'm kind of making up. Chicken and stuffing bake, a leftover night. Cheeseburger macaroni from Let's Cook Y'all. Pasta fagioli leftovers, um, another leftover night. Taco spaghetti, leftovers, and then we'll have Thanksgiving. So this is everything that I got at Kroger. I spent $78.84. They had some Friday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday only deals and some buy 10, save five, which I actually picked up some of the buy 10, save five stuff the uh, Monday of this week. Andy wasn't feeling good on Monday. He wanted some orange juice, so we went in there. We saw that they were having the sale, and we picked up some of those canned vegetables. So that's just a couple extras that I picked up. So starting with this, this was one of those Friday, Saturday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday only deals. The Kroger was, uh, the toilet paper was three fifty, and the paper towels were three fifty. Got Elijah's pull ups. Those are five ninety nine each. Some like wavy. Oh no, I got the wrong chips. I thought I got the wavy ones. No! Well, I got classic potato chips. The big bag was $2.19. Doritos were $1.99 with the buy 10, save 5. Sour cream. All of this, I got 20 things was part of the buy 10, save 5. So Doritos were $1.99. Sour cream was $1.39. The cream of soups were $0.49. Cents. So I got two mushrooms and six chickens. We got two cans of peas and two more cans of green beans because we have a lot already. I got some pasta. These were on sale for 49 cents. So two spaghettis and elbows. And then the Progresso was part of it too. So they were 99 cents each. So I picked up more, three more hearty tomatoes. Got some onion, cucumbers, grape tomatoes for $2.99. The creamy ranch, I think it was two for three. So like $1.50. This is the fried rice seasoning mix I use oh. when I make fried rice. It was 85 cents. Found some, <coughs> found some cubed ham on Markdown for 99 cents. Those will be good in omelets or something. Some sliced American mm. cheese was $1.59. Another one of the Friday, Saturday sales was the Kroger cheese was 99 cents. So I got a mozzarella. I have a bunch of the other cheese. The Kraft cheese was on sale with the buy 10, save five. And I picked that up on Monday with an Ibotta rebate as well. Got some pepper jack, French onion sour cream dip. This was $139. Um, this is on markdown garlic and herb jack cheese. I thought I would try it for $169. Lighter fluid for the grill, $339. The chicken nuggets were $399. The chicken strips were $499. Ham was $350 and I had a $0.75 cent off coupon. Baby carrots were $249. Eggs were $1.19, but I had a best customer bonus, and I got those for free. And then dog food was $7.99, $7 and that's it for Kroger. Okay, at Aldi, I spent $33.31. Got some tortilla chips for $0.89. Cents. These pretzel slims, I believe, were $1.39, something like that. Flour tortillas were $1.29. On the tomato, vine tomatoes were $1.89. Avocados were on sale for 49 cents. Some Jiffy Corn Muffin Mix for 49 cents. Balsamic vinegar was, I think, $2.39, which I thought was a really good price compared to Kroger and Walmart. 
got some bread. I've been making my bread, but with the birthday party, I wanted to have some on hand because I'm going to be making cake and stuff and not doing bread right now. Got seven packages of hot dog buns. They were 85 cents, and if you saw my last two-week grocery haul, you saw that I got a ton of hot dogs. So, got all of those. Broccoli was $1.99. Lettuce was 89 cents. The Moo Tubes yogurt that the kids like were, I think, $1.59. Butter was on sale for $2.29, so I picked up two of those. The sausage that the kids like was 99 cents. And then there's the, the milk that everybody's going to be like, where's the rest of the milk? And they got one because I want to make sure I have room in my fridge for other party food like the cake, the cupcakes, pasta salad, all that. I want to make sure it fits in the fridge before I buy a bunch of milk. So I have not very much milk and not very much eggs, but it's enough to get us through till Monday, probably longer than that. But I will go pick up more later next week. Okay, and here is everything from Walmart. At Walmart, I spent right at $51. I had a couple substitutions. I got two of these at Cola's. These are $2.46 each. The water, this is a substitution. I ordered the 24 pack at $2.58, and they gave me the 40 pack at $2.58. And then I ordered like the small yellow mustard. I think it was like eight ounces. And they substituted the the Walmart one, which is what I ordered, but the 20 ounce, but they gave me two. I only wanted the eight ounce one, so I have 40 ounces of mustard that I have no idea what I'm going to do with. Hopefully people use a lot on their hot dogs at the party. Then I got this sweet relish. I actually ordered the Walmart brand one, but they substituted the Heinz. Heinz ketchup, because that's the only one we use. This was a substitution. I guess I ordered like fudge chocolate super moist cake mix, but they just substituted milk chocolate, which is perfectly fine. And then I got, those are like, I think those are like 150 each. And then these are 88 cents each, the Walmart brand like extra confetti, it's like the funfetti cake mix. Got two of those. I don't know that I'll need all of that cake mix, but I wanted to make sure I had enough. And two things of traditional pasta sauce, they're like 88 cents, 248 for some lemonade. This one was, I think, 98 cents for the whipped buttercream frosting, and then these are like $1.50 for the butter cracker rainbow chip. Got some black olives for like 88 cents. Coffee was $2.58. Black pepper, I think, was $3.28. A dollar for the chili seasoning. $1.50, I think, for the red enchilada sauce. $1.74 for each of these apple juices. And then I always make deviled eggs for Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter, pretty much any time somebody wants me to, but I didn't have an egg carrier, so I bought this one for $3.74 from Walmart, and it will hold 20 halves, so that is perfect, and then I needed some printer paper, and this was, I think, like $2.75 or something, so I picked that up as well, and that is everything from Walmart. I almost forgot to mention that they gave us this little goodie bag. It's like a little mini reusable shopping bag. The kids are excited to use this for their little play grocery store. But it was filled with all these little goodies. So I got two coupons, one for the RX bar, one for the Black Forest fruit snacks. And then we got a little like Hot Wheels sized car with a tomato on top, the Walmart grocery. A Quaker Overnight Oats. This Love Beauty and Planet shampoo and conditioner, some Alka Seltzer, some Alka Seltzer heartburn relief chews, and you'll use that. The little RX bar and some fruit snacks. I thought that was really cool that they gave that to us as a little goodie bag. And like I said, I still have to go back to the store for milk and eggs and possibly a few other things. I wanna go ahead and pick up a turkey since we're having it at our house and I have room in my freezer. Probably gonna go ahead and pick it up while it's on sale and get that out of the way. But that is it for my two week haul. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye. <laughs>